Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, peoples. Welcome back, Lemon Army. I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in for another video. Today, we're going to be checking out a brand new game from Playway, the makers of Car Mechanic Simulator. Their latest rendition is something called Coal Mining Simulator. Uh, the basis of this game is, obviously, as it sounds, it means we get to work as a coal miner, operating all kinds of heavy equipment, like drill rigs and conveyor belts and dump trucks, and even get to play with a little bit of dynamite. So if you want to tune in, uh, just start a brand new game and see how it goes. All right, right out of the gate, the frames are just freaking ridiculous. Just a just a prologue. I will have all the links down below in the description if you guys would like to check the game out for yourself. It is currently free available right now. They have a demo. you can obviously check out and be completely free. So, there's the ground truck. I'm sure we'll figure out the truck. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's see what this do. Oh, okay, we have to come back to a conveyor belt, okay? Drive on over. You guys are going to the mine. Oh, what the hell? I didn't know we were going to be playing SnowRunner. Jesus. The Avedo Coal Mine. Did I really just high center this big ass thing? Yes, I did. I high centered an imp truck. That's awesome. Leave it to me to high center something like that, huh? All right, clean up the mine and use left mouse button to throw away junk. All right, so I guess we throw it away there. Is there anything I've learned from other games from Playway is that you always want to get the big stuff first because otherwise the rest of the stuff ain't gonna fit. Although I don't really know why we're throwing away when it literally says dynamite on the box. Like, hope it explodes on the way to the trash dump. Kind of funny. Seven. Eight. for a three-pointer here. Oh, I missed. Now, I have played just a little bit before, just so I can get the bearings and stuff on the game. I've already found a couple bugs, and I'm going to be some videos to play away. But overall, so far, the game has been pretty, pretty awesome. All right, sell junk. But I didn't give any damn money. Where's my money? Go to the office, turn on the tablet, and accept a new quest in the uh, missions tab. Missions is okay. Complete. Connect two generators to power up conveyor belt. Oh. Okay. Uh. Okay. So here's one. And I gotta go over there. Plug in. All right. Flip all these on. Boom. The bear belt is on. And enter the road header our drill in order to drill out the tunnels and all that kind of stuff. I don't know why they didn't have us get rid of all this stuff too, but you know, but whatever. We get in here, do all these. We 
And you do get different uh, cameras too, so if you want you have control of your camera pen. Or you can go outside view like this, which is what I like to use. Turn that off for now. Come back out. It says I gotta enter the underground truck. Basically a dump truck. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Alright, turn it on. Connect that up. And now we're gonna destroy rocks using the road header and we gotta collect 50 rocks. Can't tell you though, the, the first part of this is kind of slow, but I kind of expect that from like when you first start any game. And like I said, I have already played a little bit of it, so I know it's going to say like to collect 50 rocks or whatever, but I'm going to go past that so that way we can maximize. Because as you can see, our truck capacity down there in the lower right hand corner is only 50%. So I'd rather maximize our loads. good position because if you don't put this in a good position when you come back with the, uh, the underground truck kind of makes it a pain in the butt to park behind it one thing I do think that they need to improve on though is that the truck does not move with the road header so I think that should probably be changed and disconnect The other thing I don't like is that this uh, truck cannot steer without having to press forward or reverse, which this is a segmented truck, so it should be able to turn on its own without having to do that. There we go. Now all of our stuff is on the conveyor belt. Disconnect. And then you'll see up in the upper right hand corner how much of the, each material we got. So the materials is hard, hard coal, shungite, and anthracite. Also, the other thing is, is the regular brake on this thing is really, really slow. Uh, whereas the hand brake is pretty much instantaneous stop. As you can see, we got 200 kilograms of hard coal, 105 shungite, and zero anthracite. Get back in the road header. Sorry about that. 
that, I just uh, realized the game. Just realized the game was like super loud, so I just turned that down a little bit. My apologies. So as I was saying, is you want to park it in a good spot because that's what determines where the box is behind the road header. Yeah, and the camera is a little wonky too. It's like super, super finicky. It's like you can barely move your mouse and it'd be halfway across the damn screen. All right, so that's kind of funny. Apparently, uh, if you hit disconnect beforehand you can't use your little thing so there should be i think some sort of trigger there in order to prevent you from doing that kind of thing otherwise you're just going to be walking or driving around with your your uh your bed lifted up Once I get to this next mission, I'm just going to uh, probably put you guys in a, in a time lapse because I know you don't want to sit there and watch all that. And say either that or I'll just let it skip. Like one of the two. Because I know you don't want to be sitting here for like 45 minutes watching them just drill away at some rocks. Most of you watching this, you're probably just gonna watch it just to see if it's a game that would interest you. stuck on Oh, I just realized I, I, I'm a ghost. I'm just a ghost driving this truck. Yeah, I also believe that they should uh, modify these trucks to have a stronger pivot. Dumped half my freaking load on the ground there.
Just dump coal on the conveyor belt and check the tablet in your office. Go to the trade tab. Oh, well. Okay. Alright, so I guess then we're just going to be selling everything, so... All right, so they're offering us the most for hard coal, so we're going to take them. Uh, we're getting the most for anthracite here. And Shungite is these guys. Uh, let's go ahead and sell all that. Sell all that. All right. Press tab to enter management view. Press the left mouse button on the Doug Rock. Oh, yeah. And select the option of placing the tunnel in the given place. All right, so we got high tunnel and low tunnel. We can go with high. Press the question mark uh, to check for deposit amount and return. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, there we go. Find more coal so you can afford a drill rig. So this is the part I was talking about. I will leave you guys in a uh, probably just skip ahead and then see you guys here in a little bit. All right, and welcome back, everybody. As I finally just uh, if you skip there, I've earned myself enough money to buy the drill rig. So we're going to hop on in here. Oh, and I still got a little bit of coal left over, apparently. Get rid of that real quick. There we go. Now we're going to go ahead and buy our uh, drill rig right here. Get one of these. Good job. As you can see, the drill rig you purchased was delivered directly to your sh or to your mine. All right. Uh, it says we also have to purchase a security compartment. Okay. So go ahead. get one of these. All right. Uh, enter your drill rig. So he's, uh, I'm just going to go get him out of the way real quick. There we go. All right. Got an arrow above this. Uh, get a drill rig here. It says drive to the rock and place dynamite inside a single rock. Ooh. So we get to blow stuff up. I like it. That doesn't tell me which rock. So I'm just going to go to this one. Actually, no, I'm going to go over to that one. There's a tutorial for this is uh, you get to control each one of these uh, drill arms. And uh, yeah, I guess that's what you set the dynamite with. All right. Let me get you first hand view here. In with the drill and out. Oh yeah, it's definitely a set in dynamite. All right. I think I'm going to use the inside view for this. Okay, apparently you have to be like perfect on the rock. Like, do I have to be like, oh, it looks like I have to be like exactly perpendicular. All right, well, guess I'm not close enough. So we'll get a little closer. All 
Okay, there's four out of five. All right, there we go. Park the drill rig, okay. I think it's amazing, like, um, like the equipment that they use for all these kinds of like heavy low like stuff that they do like every day. I don't know. It's just kind of cool. Kind of cool. Inside the security compartment, they use the detonator. All right, this is what we all came here to see. Want to blow stuff up? Hell yeah. Excellent. Our mine has a new security compartment. All you have to do now is inside your building, close the door behind you and use the detonator. Yeah, I wish they had told me that before. Now we gotta enter the loader. This this vehicle's pretty straightforward. So you just literally drive up and get the stuff. <laughs> pretty straightforward. That's so much easier than drilling, or I mean the uh, the other one, the, the the road, whatever. Yeah, look how clean that is. Like it's perfect square. All right, back up. Get the rest of this stuff over here. I want to make sure I get all of it. down there we're sitting there saying the dynamite's a lot faster but the red header you have to like this one just requires additional steps because you have to collect it for the loader and you have a proud chance of losing more resources i don't care i like speed although in this game i don't think speed is really a thing considering that everything only moves like 10 kilometers an hour go offload that and it wants us to go back and park in our parking spot again so back up over here continue digging rocks until you gather a hundred thousand dollars all righty well with that being said is i think i will uh just go ahead and skip again, and then I'll see you at the uh, once we get our hundred grand. Alrighty, guys, so we are back. I think I've mined up enough now to get us the hundred grand. Just kind of want to see and uh, see where it gets us, because it says the end of the prologue. So I don't know if that's the end of this play test or not, but I guess we're gonna find out. I made a bunch of big about a booms, so. All right, let's see here. So, sell all the anthracite. Might not be enough. No, it is not. Well, damn. All right, well, I guess we got to blow up some more stuff, huh? Actually, I'm going to take this over here. Take the loader back but that's just because i'm lazy and that's got to be one hell of a wire right there by the way like if you're just taking this loader and running it over but as you can see i've already i've blown up a couple things here so should be a uh, well, big old boom or in the, the famous words As like the famous words of the guy uh, that did the, was a sham wow, you know, that's a lot of damage. So, so we'll see. Get, get a couple more bottle booms up in here. Yeah, uh, this camera is so sensitive.
stick over here. Get that drilled in over here. And then we will go back and make this thing go boom. I know you guys love the boom. Wait a sec, I mean, I love the boom. I think it was just a bunch of explosions is awesome, but that's just me personally. Shut the door for safety. All right, it's locked. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, thank you guys so much for checking out this uh, video. Like I said, this has been a short little play test of Coal Mining Simulator from Playway. The same people that made you Car Mechanic Simulator. I will leave you all the information down below in the description if you want to check this game out for yourself. Play tests are going on and there is also a demo for the game. And like I said, it'll be all below so you can check it all out. If you did like what you see, uh, please feel free to subscribe so that way you can see more of this uh, content and more to come along with the live streams in the future uh, if you don't mind just leave me a comment down below let me know how i'm doing if i'm sucking you know just let me know or if something's wrong with the video just let me know that too as uh constructive criticism helps everybody so thank you guys again and i hope to see you guys in the next video bye everyone